high grade one pupils boys and girls assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh i welcome you all to our lesson today hygiene and nutrition i want us to remind ourselves what we learned during our last hygiene and nutrition lesson if you remember very well last time we talked about healthy ha habits healthy habits we said our bodies need to be taken care of we said we have ways in which we can care for our body number one we talked about hand washing whereby we said dirty hands keep charms we clean hands using soap water and a towel the the work or the function of the soap is to kill charms water is to rinse our hands properly and the towel is to dry our hands then we said as far as healthy habits are concerned use of toilets or latrines i said a toilet is the one which we flush water and a latrine is the one which a hole has been dug and then a space is left for using and the latrines are commonly found in rural areas which we call rushago toilets should be cleaned daily we should bath urine and feces in the toilet boys pass urine in a urino we should flush the toilet after use we should not keep ourselves we should not help ourselves in the bush then we said as human beings we need enough sleep and uh, rest after working all day long the body needs the re to rest we should sleep earlier in order to have enough rest then we said edit habits we need to drink safe water when i talk about safe water this is clean water pupils drinking water should be clean that is when we say clean it should be cleaned it should be boiled or made safe for drinking by using chemicals then we said not using excess salt and the sugar the body needs little sugar and the salt we should put less salt on food we should put little sugar in tea and the borage then we said eating healthy foods eating healthy keeps our body strong and uh, healthy some of the healthy foods are apple watermelon fish ugali milk and eggs then we said as far as healthy habits are concerned we need playing playing makes our body grow strong and healthy we talked about different games which we play such as rope skipping jumping up and down jogging on the spot and uh, swimming pupils today we are not learning more i am giving you questions of food on of hygiene and nutrition question one it says we should wash our hands you tell me after or before 
Number two, we should wash hands, dust, fisting, the toilet, after or before. We wash hands using the, uh, we have A, you feel the missing letter, B, you feel the missing letter. Number four, dirty water keeps dust, germs, insects, uh, cracks, you tell us. Number five, we dry hands using dash, handkerchief, towel, leaves. Six, boys pass urine in dash, is it a urino, river, or bush? You underline one word. Number seven, we should dash the toilet after use wash, flush, leave. Eight, toilets should be cleaned dash daily weekly once a month once a month once a month if it is once a month you underline one then number nine that dirty toilet smell if you come across a dirty toilet how does it smell good nice bad you underline one word then number ten every Every child needs enough dash and 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 the rest sleep toys food you underline one word number 11 drinking water is made safe by how do we make drinking water safe boring boiling filtering you underline one word number 12 we should drink dash water clean, dirty, juicy. 13. I should put the dash sugar in tea. Little, a lot, much. 14. I should not pu put a lot of dash in food. Salt, sugar, tea. 15. Healthy foods keep dash away. Germs, diseases, healthy. That one brings us to the end of our lesson grade one pupils after you have done the work you take a picture you send it through whatsapp for marking through the number 07200 86844 i wish you a nice blessed day may allah bless you assalamu alaikum wa wa barakatuh.